I want the dim sum to be infused with gin, not just pairing, but infused with gin. Can or not? Very innovative, very creative, yeah. and very daring, very adventurous. Yeah, so yeah. Welcome back to Hospitality Asia channel on Hapa TV. I'm Jennifer Ong and we're here today again with Mr. David Ong, Executive Assistant Manager from Pavilion Hotel Kuala Lumpur, managed by Banyan Tree. And we're going to talk about what Pavilion Hotel Kuala Lumpur has to offer in 2023. Welcome back, David. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you once again for being back here on Hapa TV. So let us, well, we spoke about Banyan Tree uh, earlier in the, mm. in, in the earlier episode. Let's come now to Pavilion Hotel. Mm. And again, of course, before I start, I must congratulate uh, Mr. David Ong's team and Pavilion Hotel Kuala Lumpur for being nominated again as one of the best hotels in Kuala Lumpur and of course in Malaysia, for the Harpa Awards Malaysia Series 2022-2023. So, big congratulations. Thank you very much. Yeah. So, let's now talk about Pavilion Hotel. We spoke about the other hotels, right? Now, first of all, you know, again, we want to really congratulate you all for, you know, being so resilient, you know, keeping the hotel there mm -hmm. and making a comeback. So, how has it been then for Pavilion Hotel during the COVID time, during the pandemic time? Was the hotel closed? And, you know, how did you keep the team together? Well, uh, yes, the hotel did close for one or two months. Right. But after that, uh, they, the MCO started to relax uh, mm. during the COVID days. Mm. Uh, then we, 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 we put together a whole team again uh, to clean up the hotels. Right. Every corner of the hotels, uh, including the rooms. Mm. And subsequently, when, when, when the business is back, all of us actually also do the same uh, housekeeping role mm. and go up to the room, clean the rubbish, tear the, 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 the bed sheets, and, 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 and that's how we, we bonded together. Mm. Yeah. Right. So again, you kept the team, and you know, again, you know, everybody came on, yeah. you know, came on, and, and, and did yes. all the things and brought together, learned new skills, learned again, new skills just like similar. And, uh, and it's all from different departments. That's a good thing. Yeah. yeah, and we know and understand what they are doing. Amazing. Especially yeah. the housekeeping, the stewarding, all those. Yeah. So now the whole team is multi-skilled. Yes. <laughs> How wonderful that's, is that's that? That's what is, uh, hospitality is, right? It is, isn't yeah. it? Yeah? yeah, it's really getting your hands into every division. And I think hospitality is amazing because there's so many different divisions and parts that forms together yeah. a hotel, right? Unlike in a business, yeah, you know, you have your usual finance and, and sales and everything else. Yeah. But in a hotel, you know, I, I call all of these people unsung heroes they're all <laughs> heroes they're all superheroes Thank right you. yes and it's it, it's good it's really great to see yeah. that kind of um, uh you know bond and team spirit yeah to keep it together yeah every position is is a pillar mm. from the top to the you know to 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 the service staff right yeah. right so okay so the pavilion hotel is managed by banyan tree yes so the team actually again is there any connection with the banyan tree team well, we are one team. We mm. are part of the Banyan Tree uh, group mm. and we manage these two hotels together. Yeah. Ah, uh, so it's, it's, but not every staff, of course, not every not team every member, team. right? Not every team. Example, like a restaurant, you have it in um, Pavilion Hotel, let's say, for example, Jet Pavilion, that would be the team that would be there. But for, let's say, Banyan Tree, you have Horizon Grill, but Horizon Grill team will be there. But right. for management and other staff, they actually go around um, right. helping and, and doing their task. Okay. Yeah. So does that mean then the, the, the standards of the hospitality standards, the service standards, the quality standards, are they then the same? Are they, you know, in terms of two brands? They're pretty the same because we are managed by Banyan Tree. Yeah. So yeah, they so. keep that standards within mm. that Banyan Tree. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Great. So let, let, let's talk about Pavilion Hotel. Let's talk about, you know, what are the features? What are the USP of Pavilion yeah. Hotel? And uh, hold on. How long has Pavilion Hotel been around now? I think three years, coming to four. Coming to four yeah. years, huh? Yeah. Wow, Nine, we opened in 2019. Just before pandemic, mm, huh? 2019, wow. yeah. Ouch. Yeah, okay. <laughs> All right. So, okay, what are, what are the features? What are the great features? What are the USP of Pavilion Hotel? Um... We 
are actually situated at the heart of Bukit Bintang. Mm. And the greatest USP that we have, we are connected to uh, Pavilion KL Mall. Right. That is the, you know, the best that uh, we have to offer within our hotel's vicinity. Wow, okay, so shopaholics, yeah, out there, you know that you want to do a staycation, pick Pavilion, yes. because you can just hop onto a mall with, you know, through a lift, yes. just one just one, one exit point, yeah. one entrance point. Directly to the mall. <laughs> right. Okay, so um, what about the, 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 the F&B outlets, you know, the features of F&B? Do you have, you know, the spa, for example, the number of F&B yeah, outlets? Um, for spa, we plan to reopen um, next year, mm -hmm. but uh, stay tuned. Um, for F&B, we offer um, all-day dining, which is the courtyard, mm. uh, beautiful buffet mm. for weekends, mm. and uh, you can do uh, small events, mm. right? even larger events is fine because we have a center court uh, within the hotel to to cater for receptions, wedding receptions. Right. And um, what's the capacity there? Probably around 200 persons. It's quite yeah. rich, yeah? yeah? Okay. Yeah. Right. So a very nice environment, it's covered, you know, so uh, we, 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 we done out the place quite nice right. for that area. Okay, so apart from the courtyard? We see. have a, a Cantonese restaurant, Chinese restaurant, a Jit Pavilion. Mm. I, you must come and try the food. <laughs> it's really, really, really nice. I happen to have gone for a food tasting mm. at Jit, trying out their new menu, the new Tim Sum. And then I met the chef. And then I, I had a crazy idea and I said, Chef, are you out for something that's really, really funky? And he said, yeah, why not? You know, Jennifer, we're all, you know, now into the new, into the new dining experience. So I said, okay, are you keen to explore doing a dim sum pairing with gin? Mm. Yeah. So, and I told him, I said, Chef, I want the dim sum to be infused with gin, not just pairing, but infused with gin. Can or not? And he said, yes, can. Come, let's do it. Right? And we organized a special dining uh, together with a group of, um, you know, people who just love food, like the wine and diners. And uh, we did that for, for, you know, one of the nights for 12, we had about 12, 15 packs. Uh, and I must tell you, David, I must agree with you. It is one of the most amazing Chinese cuisine, um, dim sum, you know, not just dim sum we had, you know, the, the of course the main courses and dim sum mix yes. and yes. infused with gin. And it was like, wow, one of the really, really, really great effort from, from the chef, you know, very, very innovative, very creative yeah. and very daring, very adventurous. Yeah. So yes. So David's right. They if you to want fight. to try Chinese, please do go to Jade because it's 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 amazing, really. The food's good. Yes, the food's good. Yeah. So I hope it stays that way. No, it because will stay <laughs> because recently I just went and have a a, a a meal or with a friends, a group of friends. Right. They'll say one of the best restaurants that yeah. they've tried for the Chinese food or yeah. the Cantonese food. Okay. So it's been verified, yes. yeah? It's been verified, yeah. 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 So just hope that David maintains and make sure they maintain they their quality. They say they will come back. So, okay, <laughs> I wait for them. <laughs> okay, okay. I will go back too, yeah? So so that's good. Yeah. Okay, so what else? You've got the courtyard. You've got Jade. Yeah, Jade. What, what are they? We have the another, uh, the Cove, which is a, a sort of a lounge uh, place. Right. You can have a, a easy night there. Mm. Uh, sometimes we also have the karaoke is it outdoor? room. Is it outdoor? It's at is level it 7 the... M. Okay. Yeah. It's right. a, in the hotel. I it's see. a very nice, cool place for a drink with your friends for the night out. Right. It's also quite popular. Okay, that's yeah. nice. So that's three. And what else do you have? Um, we have a good um, conference meeting rooms. Mm. Especially, especially when we have these uh, uh, weddings. We mm. know like COVID time, most of them cannot Nobody do the weddings. <laughs> so the weddings for this year was very packed. Right. In fact, it go all the way until next year. Right. So we have a good banquet team, a mm. good sales and catering team mm. to cater for them. And what, what's the size of your ballroom? Um, about 40, 50 tables, 40 tables. Right. Oh, so you get about quite, 40, quite 50? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We have okay. a two... Uh, a big ballroom. Yeah. yeah, and it's all fully equipped. Is yes, it equipped, equipped digitally? Yes, yes, yes. Fully equipped. It, it was. Yeah. Right. Right. Yeah. Okay. Last meeting we can hold there, no problem. Nice. Yeah. Nice. Okay. So you've got the restaurants. You've got the 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 um, uh, ballroom. We've got 
I'm sure you probably have a, a few function rooms as well. Yes, we have a meeting rooms, rooms, nice meeting rooms. Okay. All within the level seven. I see. Yeah. And, and, and your spa. Yes. So the spa is opening next year? Uh, yeah, we're planning and prepare for it. Yeah. Right, okay. Mm, Any tuned. time yet? Yeah, Any indication tuned. yet? Yeah, no. Any new things for the spa? Well, <laughs> you know, Bayan Tree is famous for the spa, mm. right? So that spa also with the Bayan Tree DNA. Ah, ah, so the reopening has got DNA from Banyan yes, Tree, yeah. Definitely. It's a very resort feel, and yes. you know, right? Banyan Tree is like, wow, okay, you've you, you've got to experience the way they pamper their guests. Yes. Yeah. Okay, that's really cool. Yeah. All right. So, what is going to be different for guests in terms of guest experience? What will be different from, you know, from Pavilion Hotel uh, coming to 2023? Well, we have um, 325 rooms. And we cater for business, leisure, conference, uh, families to come to stay with us. And we will give them what we can, the best out of us mm. as uh, Bayantri people. Mm. And uh, of course, uh, you know, they come here maybe either for a short trip or shopping. <laughs> well, that's, that's really to them, but we will take care of them on behalf of our hotels. Uh, yeah, again, yeah. Nice. and again, does it have the... The banyan pre, during, after. Oh, definitely. It's, <laughs> it's the same whole style, but it's not how you want to feel it and you have to come and stay with us. Yeah. And you have it, yeah. Very nice, yeah. So if you want to experience how different it is, you know, to be pampered, not just during the stay, but before, during and after, then obviously you can experience it at the Pavilion Hotel because it's all managed by Banyan Tree and that's where you get that personalized yes. service. Right. That's right. It's great, great, yeah. So, shopaholics out there, yeah, Christmas time is coming if they still have rooms because I think they're fully booked as well. Yeah. But do, do pop in and, you know, and uh, experience the Malaysian hospitality from Pavilion Hotel, Kuala Lumpur, managed by Banyan Tree. Yeah, so I was with David Ong, Executive Assistant Manager from Pavilion Hotel Kuala Lumpur, managed by Banyan Tree. And thank you once again, David, for thank being you, Jen, here. Thank you, Jen, for helping us, having us here. Wonderful, wonderful for being here. So again, wishing you all the best for 2023. Happy New Year and hope to see you again soon in our next few episodes. Thank you, Thank David. You. Happy New Year to everyone. Thank you.